Crazy enough, I think this actually came from a collector because look at that, no scratches at all. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna keep this. Well, it depends. It's like it depends on how it's gonna go down. I think I might keep it. Then we have Need for Speed High Stakes, and again, Need for Speed. This Need for Speed as well has came from a freaking damn collector. There's not really. Well, I guess there is scratches, but not any scratches that actually makes it totally like a oh damn, why did I pick it up? Next is one of the worst games. Well, it's not because of it's the worst game, it's more because of freaking Pixels the movie that made Cubert into a yeah, I most likely think I'm not gonna keep Cubert because of that freaking movie. Yeah, they should have just did the right thing and actually made her a trophy. Instead, they decided to turn Qbert into the hot girl. Thus, yeah, remembering Qbert from that movie because of that movie, it makes me not want to have this game. So I'm not sure I'm going to keep it or not. Next is Driver Two. I picked up Driver One, so here's Driver Two. Let's see. Footloose that lets you hit the streets and commandy any vehicle. Hmm. Partner up with any for split screen and so, hmm. Interesting. I did open it and see part one. Here's part two. So disc one, disc two, disc one. Stop it. You idiot. There we go. Disc one, perfect. Extremely perfect. Then check out disc two. Thank goodness disc two is available. I don't know. Maybe I should keep this game because I don't have it and you can't actually maybe roam the streets so might keep it and then the game I'm not going to keep is the world is not enough. As you can see there's some freaking breaks and stuff. Not sure if this came from the collector. It does have rings and stuff so I don't know if the collector kind of slipped on this one or it came from someone else. I'm not sure. But last but not least is one that I already have. Boom blocks, but I don't have the cover. And I certainly did have the freaking manual. It's I guess it might be better than mine. But anyways. I almost caught him slipping, but sadly the cashier caught them slipping and said nope I'm gonna correct it so it says 199 that that week it actually was the white one gets half off so technically I should have got this for 99 cents and usually it's 299 so she decided to say okay well here I'll give it to you for exactly how much it says on the case which means I didn't even I mean I got them but I didn't caught yeah, so I wonder if she actually got something very special for catching them being like, no, no, wait, this should be $2.99. So I don't know. It's like, I don't freaking know. Anyways, here is all that I got. Another PlayStation filled week with Boom Blocks, but Boom Blocks, it's amazing that it was $1.99. Yeah, too bad. It, it would turn $1.99, but technically, if I really got them, it would have been $0.99, cents, but apparently, psh, so, yeah. Anyways, I'll catch you guys next time.